Hello, welcome to the fifth video tutorial for Slideshow Digital Signage app for Android. Today, I will show you how to set up automatic synchronization of files from your Dropbox account to Slideshow. On the left side of the screen, you can see an Android emulator running Slideshow app. On the right side, there is a web browser on my computer. I am currently logged in to Slideshow's web interface. I will open menu tools and select periodical download. There I can select Dropbox and click on login. A login page will open on the Android screen. I will enter my credentials to the Dropbox account. You have to enter the credentials only for the first setup. After logging in, I have to allow access to the Dropbox for Slideshow. Now I'm successfully logged in and I can switch back to the Slideshow app. Next step is setting download interval in Slideshow's settings. I will set it for 600 seconds, meaning Slideshow will automatically synchronize folders we will select from Dropbox every 10 minutes. For applying this change, I have to reload the app. I will now switch to the Dropbox page in my web browser. You can see that I have single folder with three images. Through the periodical download page in Slideshow, I can set up synchronization of this folder to Slideshow's root folder. I will use the download now link to immediately trigger the synchronization so we don't have to wait for the full 10 minutes. You can see that Slideshow started displaying the images from Dropbox and in File Manager you can confirm that all three images have been successfully synchronized. Now I will change the file name of one image in Dropbox. I will add suffix underscore DIL underscore 1990 January 1st. This means that this particular file should be deleted on January 1st, 1990 in the past, so Slideshow shouldn't even download it. I again trigger download now, and you can see that Slideshow synchronized only two images this time. If I change the date to January 1st, 2030, in the future, Slideshow will download the file this time. Of course, for your usage, you can enter closer date or combination of date and time. Through File Manager, you can see that the delete date is set to year 2030 and Slideshow will automatically delete this file upon reaching the date. That's all for today. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial. You can download Slideshow app for free through Google Play Store or through website slideshow.digital.